coal pipes, launch box, arcade set, running big box, we can run regular launch box, have a couple options here. In this video, we're gonna show you how I got it all set up. Go ahead and show you exactly what's on here, all the different games, do some gameplay, do some exploring, and just see how well-rounded and done out this particular uh, set is. It was really nice, everything from loading screens, bezels, one of the largest arcade sets I've ever seen complete. You really gotta see this one. It's a nice, nice arcade set. Light gun games, you know, all the goodies. So the entire complete play arcade set is 141 gigabytes, 152 billion bytes. There are three updates here. Um, well, first off, you have lots of zip files here. <clears throat> you wanna go ahead and unzip 00.1, 7-zip, unzip that. That's your main arcade pack. And then you have three more files here. These are three separate files. So you wanna unzip each one, unzip, unzip, and unzip all three. And you're gonna be left with these four files from all these zip, um, these compressed files. Now, <clears throat> these are updates here. He explains what 1.1, 1.2, and 1.3 does, and it's right here. So 200 backgrounds to the platform in this update, fixed arcade platform to point to the right emulator, so you definitely wanna get 1.2. And then 1.3, removed three non-playable games, fixed three Marvel games, added generic bezels, uh, fixed Darkstalkers, um, a couple other little things. So this does require you to have the base image though. So here I have my complete play base edition, which is like over 200 gigabytes. It has the rocket launcher. It has the launch box installed on it. Everything is here you want. Um, do note you want to buy a license if you want to be able to use big box for this particular build. Now, so what I'm going to do here is just transfer these over. I'm just going to cut it and paste it into there. And then the next one, I'm gonna cut it and then paste it after this is done moving here. So I'm gonna just manually do that for all these updates, starting with 1.1, 1.2, 1.3. Then I'm gonna update this arcade. And then lastly, the last thing you're gonna do is go to your complete play base edition. And here's your new complete play arcade. Let's go ahead and replace that. And here's your new complete play arcade. Once I've updated all this, the new arcade edition. I'm gonna add the arcade edition into my base edition over here. Just the emulators and launch box folders go where the emulator and launch box folders are within the complete play edition. So that's the last thing I'm gonna do is just transfer that over to here and replace any files. And then we're just gonna go ahead after that and launch launch box or big box, depending on how you wanna launch it. And we should now have all those MAME arcade sets, no intros, looking good, nice set. So let's uh, fast forward to that. So this might all seem very similar to you. This is the uh, original base image, but now we have Arcade here. It actually already had CPS 1, 2, and 3 games on here from the base image, and it actually already had the Sega Model 2 and Sega Model 3. While I might consider those arcades, um, you know, those were included on the original base image. Now the arcade set though is tw almost just shy of 2,800 games, 2,785. And the thing I like about it is there's no leaf left unturned, no rock left unturned, whatever the analogy is. There's everything. And in particular, why I was really excited about this was with the light gun games. So yes, this has your light gun games on it. It has Alien 3, uh, the, Arc the gun game. I went down to Lethal Enforcers. Um, it has Bucks Deer Hunting on here. Um, you should have Zombie Raid under Z somewhere Z O you have zero point on here great great light gun game and zombie raid so really cool but then you also have all the good stuff too like NBA Jam and uh, Donkey Kong and Pac-Man and Outrun and all your classics um, off-road you have the new off-road challenge the old off-road classic uh, sports games NBA Jam NBA Jam Extreme hang time maximum hang time play to play by play a um, lot of you know gems here. Mortal Kombat 4, Mortal Kombat 3. So this is really nice. Uh, Metal Slugs, Michael Jackson's Moonwalker, awesome game there. So this is um, in Marvel vs. Capcom. So this is the um, the launch box regular. I have a licensed version. If you download this, you know, and you don't have a launch box license, it should say like free edition up in the upper right hand corner. But um, you know, this is one way to look at all these games through the actual launch box. What you can also do is exit out of here and just launch Big Box. Or I think you can even launch Big Box from here. Visualizing Big Box. 
So here we are in Big Box, and now we should be able to just scroll all the way up to Arcade. I guess it's, uh, MAME. Yeah, so it's just MAME, which is Arcade. And you get your information, we can go ahead and click in. It says unknown, because, you know, different arcade cabinets had different specifications as far as memory and processors and things. How cool is this? Let's just take K for a second here. You can scroll up faster. You gotta let it load up a little bit though. It's a Jurassic Park, the arcade game. Nice graphics, you can click in. Um, I don't know if this will load the game yet. Usually there's a secondary screen. You can change that though. Within Big Box, you can say that you wanna just go ahead and launch it from that screen, but look at all the other stuff you can do. Mark is broken, complete, add it to the playlist. You can go ahead and view the video snap full screen. Go ahead and exit. You can go ahead and view the image full screen. Hey, hey. Wow. It's a lot of graphics. <laughs> I like that picture. That's cool. Um, you can even rate it. You know, you can rate your games as well. Jumbo Shot. Joust, Joust 2. What is the looks? I always forget the looks of Joust 1 versus Joust 2. Let's try Joust 2. Go ahead and launch it. It's like a roulette wheel right here. Hyper Pac Man.
Oh boy. Oh! I thought it was gonna be this whole level, but I was like... Bad. Got him. In case you're wondering what exact games are in here, let's go through alphabetically, starting with numbers in A, and then we'll go all the way down to Z. Thank you. 
All right, so there you have it, coal pipes, another awesome set. Um, really liking it a lot. Um, this is becoming my go-to as far as if I'm gonna build a light gun cabinet now, I'd probably go with this build, especially over coin ops, as far as already done out. This is one of the most complete builds I've ever seen between all the add-ons he has, um, especially, like I said, for light guns. Um, depending on what you want, you know, I've seen coin op builds with, you know, they have the PC games and some other things that it doesn't have to offer, but uh, for what it is here, amazing stuff. So two thumbs up, don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll catch you on the next one.